So let us discuss uh, what is a decimal number system. So it is a fast uh, part we need to know whenever we are going to learn about the digital electronics. So first concept is the number system and in number system, so we have something called decimal number system. So we have other number systems as well. So what are that first one is decimal, then we can have a binary number system, then we can have a octal number system and then we have a <coughs> hexadecimal number system. So like this different different number systems are there. So basic operation and the principle of all the number system is change uh, means different but uh, there are some uh, uh, fixed things for particular number system so we will be looking into that. So first is in this video we will be discussing about decimal number systems. So what is a decimal number system? So decimal number system is the number system that, that we use in our day to day life okay, right. So uh, if we purchase something the currencies and all we say decimal we al always use the decimal number system basically decimal number system is used for the human beings but computers do not don't understand that they understand binary number system and hexadecimal so we will be further looking into that. So what is a decimal number system? So in this first of all what digits we use? So what are the digits? So, you know in decimal number system day to day life what we use so we say 10, 20, 23, 49 or 103 so like this any number you are using in day to day life for any like 2 kg, 10 kg, 5 kg and the speed and all the things so everything is a decimal number system. So here the point here is so we are writing 1, 0, 2, 0, 2, 3 then 4, 9, 1, 0, 3 so the individual things or the individual numbers we are writing this individual numbers we are writing so these are called the digits and in decimal number system we use how many digits we use there the digits from 0 to 9 so basically the word decimal is coming from the word called as deca so deca is related to 10 okay so we use the digits 0 to 9 in this type of number system so <coughs> that means 0 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. So these are the numbers that we have to use to represent any quantity in a decimal number system. Now when it comes to technicality and definition, so decimal number system has two things, means every number system has two things. So we will be uh, learning about all those things for the, all the decimal numbers. So in decimal number system. <coughs> So two things are one is the base is called as 10 base 10 and the digits are and the digits used right digits used as 0 to 9 okay 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9. So now what is this base so actually this base decides that how many number of digits can be used num in the number system that means if I write base 10 that means 10 number of digits can be used okay what are the 10 number of digits so this is my 0 to 9 is my 10 number of digits okay so next is how do we write a particular uh, decimal number to represent it so generally we write a decimal number system with a number let's say i take 73 and in the subscript we write this 10 so this 10 is nothing but this is the base of the number. So generally it is written as 73 is the digit or the 73 is the number and we represent that with the base 10 and how do we write it with place values. So if I write the place values then it will be 7 into 10 power 2 sorry 7 into 10 power 1 plus 3 into 10 power 0. So this is how the number is represented with respect to its base value. Here the base value is 10. So we have to multiply a factor of 10 here. This side is called as the LSB lowest significant bit or least significant bit and this side is the MSB most significant bit, bit we say. Now how I am writing this 10 power 1, 10 power 0, how do I know this? So basically this is the 0th place and this is the first place. 
So like this, let us see in uh, another number with uh, four digits. So let's say 2423. Okay, so this number is in base 10. Now how do we represent with its base value? So if we represent, so see how many places are there? Zeros place, first place, second place and third place. So if you write that, it will be 2 into 10 power 3 plus 4 into 10 power 2 plus 2 into 10 power 1 plus 3 into 10 power 0. So if you add all these numbers, then you will be getting this number. So how? See, 2 into 10 power 3 means 2000 plus 4 into 10 power 2 means 400 plus 2 into 10 power 1 means it is 20 plus 3 into 10 power 0 means 3 into 1. So 10 power 0 is nothing but 1. So plus 3. So this final value will be 2, 4, 2, 3. Okay, this is how you represent a number system with its place value. So later on there are different techniques how to represent different number system in uh, another number system. We say that as conversion of number systems. So once we know all the uh, number system, then we will be going towards the uh, conversion of the number system. So from this video we will be ending here and in the next video we will see another number system or we will see that what is a binary number system, octal number system and hexadecimal number system.